This video goes over question four of the derivatives from the basic definition assignment. So the definition is f prime of x equals the limit as h approaches zero of f at x plus h minus f of x all over h. And before we do this one, because this is cubed, we need to review expanding a binomial to the third power. So I'm going to have to expand x plus h cubed. And I use what's called Pascal's triangle. 1, 3, 3, 1. Then the next one is 1, 4, 6, 4, 1. So we're going to use this row, which is the third row. So this is the zeroth row. First, second, third row right here. So that gives us the coefficients to use. So we get 1 times x cubed, then plus 3 times x squared h plus 3 x h squared plus 1 times h cubed. So if we do any one of these terms here, this is a 1 on the h. So at any given term, the exponents all need to add up to 3. x to the 1 plus 2 is 3 h cubed. So now I'm going to substitute in f prime of x equals the limit as h approaches 0 of negative 3 times x plus h all cubed minus negative 3x cubed all divided by h. So I'm going to expand that binomial. Got to carry the limit notation until we evaluate the limit. Negative 3 times x cubed plus 3x squared times h to the 1 or just h plus 3x to the 1 h squared plus h cubed. And then I'm going to distribute this negative sign. Negative negative is a positive positive 3x cubed. So that equals the limit as h approaches 0. And all of this is over h. So I'm going to distribute the 3 through. Negative 3x cubed minus 9x squared h minus 9xh squared minus 3h cubed plus 3x cubed all over h. And we can now cancel out the negative 3x cubed plus 3x cubed. And on this one step, I'm also going to cancel h's. That h will completely cancel one of these cancels, and one of these cancels leaving a squared. So now we've got the limit as h approaches 0 of negative 9x squared minus 9xh minus 3h squared. At this point, I can let h go to 0 without having a problem with division by 0. So my final answer is negative, we'll go to blue there. So our final answer is negative 9x squared. So f prime of x equals negative 9x squared. We'll go put that in and you can use that answer to evaluate the last three things. Negative 9x squared. Check answer. Excellent. And then 1 squared is 1, so this is going to be negative 9. Check answer. Nice work. 2 squared is 4, so 4 times negative 9 is negative 36. Check answer. Excellent again. And then 3 squared is 9. Negative 9 times positive 9, negative 81. Check answer. Nice work. 
If using the Pascal's triangle to get the coefficients method of expanding this binomial seems too hard, there is a way to do it in the calculator. You go to menu, three for algebra, three for expand, put in the x plus h, raise it to the third power, hit enter, and you get x cubed plus 3hx squared. The calculator puts it in alphabetical order. 3 plus 3h squared x plus h cubed. So you can do it that way. So I would write it as x cubed plus 3x squared h plus 3x h squared plus h cubed. So you can do that part of the problem by doing this expansion in the calculator. That concludes this video.